the cuts have affected the regions more than London. I mean, London has always been, uh, you know, the commercial thrives in London. Uh, but it, we are a touring company, for example, and we'll be able to undertake much less touring. So, yes, regional theatre is uh, threatened, and also regional audiences have been under the recession anyway become more conservative. <coughs> Excuse me. So an organisation like us, which tours new work, is doubly threatened because, A, we tour less, but also they want us less because, naturally, uh, in a recession, people make fairly conservative choices. I think there is always an urban pull to theatres, yes. But I think, on the other hand, you, you have a particularly loyal community who uh, are obviously crucial to the survival of the theatre and will... I mean, I remember going to Cheltenham, which is a not dissimilar size, uh, and it was a local arts centre community which was, um, had in fact taken fairly adventurous choices in uh, touring work from London. And uh, there was some kind of post-show discussion and I was saying that I thought the Olivier was too big and that theatres that size were... And I was attacked by somebody in the audience and another lady stood up and said, you can't say that about Max Stafford He bought Fan Shen to Cheltenham. And Fan Shen was a, a play um, about communism coming to a small community in China. So it was fairly esoteric. But because that community had been, had been nurtured on a diet of fairly avant-garde theatre, they were quite defensive about it. Obviously, theatre is, is primarily an urban phenomenon. I mean, there are companies that are specifically tour rural areas, um, and I'm sure you have those in Somerset as well. But obviously, sustainability for a theatre is dependent on, a, on an urban community, but Taunton is certainly of a sufficient size. I mean, there, there are figures that I'm not totally familiar with, but people used to say that, that in the 19th century you were never further than 12 miles from a railway station, and never further than 25 miles from a repertory theatre. I mean, now those figures must have changed enormously.